Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video I will explain William Wordsworth as a romantic poet. Let's start. William Wordsworth as a romantic poet William Wordsworth was one of the greatest protagonists of the romantic movement. His idea was to make natural things appear unnatural by adding to them the light that never was on sea or land. He had, therefore, to give the charm of novelty to everyday things and to produce a feeling analogous to the supernatural by freeing the mind's attention from the lethargy of custom and directing it to the beauty and wonders of the world beferius. The following characteristics clearly show that Wordsworth was a romantic poet. His use of imagination and a sense of wonder. In order to make common things of life and nature appear to be supernatural, Wordsworth used his imagination, thus in order to create a sense of wonder into things of commonplace importance. He made use of his power of imagination. Thus the ordinary flower, the simple shepherd, the singing cuckoo were presented by Wordsworth in an uncommon light by the power of his imagination. The common objects seem to be completely changed and transmitted when they appear in his poetry. This is the great role of Wordsworth as a romantic poet. He felt and wrote, The earth and every common sight to me did seem appeared in celestial light the glory and freshness of a dream. The addition of a sense of strangeness to the ordinary beauties of life and making of ordinary things to look as extraordinary are the two qualities of Wordsworth. And for this Wordsworth is considered as too romantic poet. The classical poets had not much respect for nature and the common man but Wordsworth took up new Subjects of poetry, his adoration of nature and the common simple life were things of romantic character. He elevated nature to the dignity of adoration gave a color of romance and glory to the simple annals of countrymen living in huts and cottages in the midst of nature-based beautiful surroundings. His theory in nature and human life was completely different from the poetry of Pope and the poets who followed him. It was Wordsworth who introduced a note of true romanticism in the poetry of the 19th century. Wordsworth's mysticism was something new of which the poets of the classical school had never experienced. The poet viewed the spirit of God pervading the entire universe both animate and inanimate. He saw the presence of the divine life in every flower, bud, insect and mossy stone. He felt the presence of the power of God in nature and in human life. He established a relationship between man and nature by some mysterious bond of connection. This fact is emphasized in his poem Tintan Abbey, I have felt a presence that disturbs me with joy, of elevated thoughts, a sense sublime, of something far more deeply interfused. His numerous lyrics, odes and sonnets were also romantic in color. In them, the note of music, imaginative supremacy and emotional excitement, the chief characteristics of romanticism were introduced in the finest possible way. In place of heroic couplet, a variety of metrical experiments were made by the poet. Conclusion To conclude it can be rightly said that Wordsworth, way of the greatest protagonist of the Romantic moment.